Hi, if you like the video, please remember to subscribe. You may remember my review of the uBlock Origin ad blocker for the desktop Chrome internet browser that I did a couple of weeks ago and how that transformed the speed of my internet, at least halving the time that was needed to load most pages. And, you know, that was fine for my laptop, but it's on the mobile web where we really suffer slow loading times. So I wanted to show you a little trick with a mobile Android Chrome browser that does a similar thing to uBlock Origin uh, on the desktop version of Chrome. What you need to do is open up the Chrome browser on your Android phone. This will probably work for other um, mobile browsers as well, and you'll just have to play around with them and see where the settings are. But in Chrome, go into the settings, scroll down to the site settings, then scroll down to the JavaScript setting, JavaScript, Java crap, JavaScript setting, tap on it, and simply disable JavaScript. Now, go back to the browser and try a few of your regular websites. And what you should find is that they load a lot faster than they used to. Because normally it's the JavaScript which is loading all the ads and lots of tracking code and all this extra rubbish that really slows down the web. Now, you may well be saying that, wait a minute, that sounds too simple. Won't disabling JavaScript break lots of sites? And the answer is yes, that it can reduce the functionality of some sites. But the great thing about our Android devices and our smartphones in general is that all the sites that require really heavy JavaScript that's useful to us, we've probably got an app on it already. For example, Gmail, uh, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, um, eBay, Amazon, Flickr. You know, all these sites have got an app which you use. So, you know, because if you go to their sites, obviously with JavaScript, not working, um, they're not going to work. But we don't go to them on our phones because we've got an app, so it doesn't matter if the web version doesn't work. Now, there may be some sites that you don't have an app for that when you visit them, they don't work. And for that site, you could simply go back into the settings and then just enable JavaScript for that session and then turn JavaScript off again. But if it's a site that you visit regularly, and again, there's no app that you could use instead, simply add the URL and then the Chrome browser will always allow the use of JavaScript for that site. So, give this no JavaScript version of Mobile Chrome a good go. I've been using it for about two weeks now, I think, and it's it's great. I do, <laughs> my mobile works so much faster, especially when I'm not on Wi-Fi, when I'm out there using my data connection. And then as you're doing it, add the necessary, necessary sites to the exceptions and enjoy a much faster mobile internet. Okay, that's enough from me. Please put any comments down below. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please subscribe and I'll see you again soon.